From apples and oranges to dollars and nonsense and one creepy smile, here are today's top lines. The best part is the eight seconds it takes for Herman Cain to smile. Here's a little taste. Have you been watching the GOP debates? Um, I'm going to wait until everybody's voted off the island. Once the ones ones they've narrowed it down to to one or two, I'll start paying attention. How much would the feds lose in revenue under your plan, Governor? I don't really worry about what the feds are going to lose. I believe it was Lyndon Johnson that said, don't these people realize that if they push me over to an extreme position that I'll lose the election? I think in his own words, he says, listen, you know, I, I need to say whatever I need to say for whatever office I'm running for. So it's, it's not correct to mix apples and oranges. Those people in the Republican primary have got to lay off this stuff. They're forcing their leaders, the, the, the front runners, into positions that will mean they lose the general election. This doesn't wash off. <laughs> I hate the Bush and bubble. I don't think being it a homosexual wash off. washes off. The idea that you stand here before us and talk about that you're strong on immigration is on its face the height of hypocrisy. <laughs> there, you guys look like you really uh, mm, don't like you too much. They've got to stop this. The federal debt is going to massively go up because of all the obligations that the federal government has. 